Hello again, everybody. It is a uh, late summer edition of the 8060 rule. Uh, I'm Mark, I'm 61. Hello, everybody. I'm Greg, and I'm 81. How are you, everybody? <laughs> nice to see you, Greg. You got a lot going on over there. Are you, are you, um, uh, you playing, uh, solitaire? No, I'm just playing. Like, all right, I'm getting ready here. Okay. Okay, you ready? Yeah. All right. Kick us off. What's going on? Uh, how about these indictments now? Um, what's the, uh, what's been happening? Um, uh, four, uh, four, uh, against Trump. 19 people have been charged in the process. We must trust the process. I always say that. And the rule of law is being tested. The rule of law will be will be um, will be done. Yeah, and I'm 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 optimistic. Meaning, I think that uh, justice will be done, and we'll all sit there and go, okay, like you said, the process worked. Um, you know, I'm I'm thinking that way. Um, however, when you when you go trust the process, um, I need to trust the person who's running the process um, uh, or, or people. So in this case, I do. Um, however, um, uh, I'm just going to say, if, if you don't mind, uh, when uh, when the former guy was in there, I don't w I wouldn't trust the process. Yeah. You know what I mean? I, I, he, it's like a shell game trying to, to. Well, uh, well, George Allen of the Washington Redskins used to say, "The future is now." So we're dealing, Mark, with a guy, with a person who we can trust is the process now. So let's not look back. Look where we are now. No, what I'm saying though, the trust the process has become this cliche. Trust the process. You can't. We. Trump has shown us that we can't trust the process if somebody untrustful is running the process. Right, but we're not. We're not. They're not. Right. I'm saying now I trust the process. Yes, that's it. Okay, I trust Jack Smith. Yeah, that's that's what I mean. That's what I'm yeah. saying. Yeah, I well, mean, I'm, I'm I'm just saying I trust that. You know, whatever happens, happens. But you I fill trust. A day. You fill a buster deck. <laughs> well, in other words, I wouldn't have trusted Bill Barr. Okay. Two years ago, two years ago. All right, right, right. That's what yeah. I'm getting at. So things are looking okay. good. Though. Things are looking good. Um, right, but uh, it's just unbelievable. But uh, yeah, things can only happen for the first time. You know, uh, uh, you never know, right? Right. Um, but there are there have been Spiro Spiro Agnew was indicted. Yes. Yes. So uh, and 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 promised never to come near. An elected office again so you know there's been governors and the governor in illinois ryan went to jail yeah for wrongdoing you, and blagojevich is, is famous was, uh, as a greek i was embarrassed with agnew as a greek right you know, yeah yeah you know, as an american i was embarrassed you know. of agnew but i was just gonna say blagojevich um infamous for for how he you know, went to jail. Yeah. So it's 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 been done. It's been done. Yeah. So uh, people have been <laughs> held accountable. People in high places have been held accountable before. So. Yeah. Yeah. You're we'll right. See. I think sometimes they're they're minimizing that. In the in the in the press. Right. Know? They use the word unprecedented. It's it's not unprecedented. Yeah. It's it's precedented. It's um. Yeah. You know. You know, we only know what we know, and if you know, if we if we don't read history, then we don't know know what happened before. Um, but anyway, it's going to be uh, nonstop stuff because, like you said, four indictments, ninety one. No, four, yeah, four indictments, ninety one counts. I don't even. People. Yeah, I don't even. Yeah. I, mean, I, I I'm you know, and I, I kind of pay attention, but I'm getting confused as to what's going the process, you know, and it's uh, whether it's federal or state. It's just interesting now. Um, yeah, it's very interesting. I, I, I guess the, the, I learned the word silver lining over the years. The silver lining is it's a wake up call for our country. Right. That don't yeah. take things for granted. Right. Don't take things for granted. Right? right. It's on me, it's on you, and it's on everybody in this country who don't vote. Right. And I vote. 
so anybody that's got these. But I do see this. I, I know this is not going to play well with some people. I will not vote for the lesser of two evils. I cannot vote going like this. Oh, okay. I cannot do that. Yeah. I'm not voting because I, out of out of passion or out of uh, belief in that person. I'm voting because the other one's worse. I don't like that. Oh, okay. Now the argument is that well, you're throwing the vote to them, the other person. Well, I don't want to say so be it, but I have my I have my belief. Yeah, but also you're a very informed voter. You. Thank you. You you pay attention. So, so we're up. Uh, there should be a no volunteer eye. I mean, people are getting so our soldiers are getting killed in other countries, as some of the other people in this country are going to bars and having a good time. Wait a minute, there's got to be some uh, call to duty, and that duty could be a hospital for six months, a prison for three months, something to a child care. You know, something to do, something that you say given to the country. Right. Jobs, whatever, you know? Yeah. I you like know? it. No. I like you got my vote. You got my vote. Okay. I mean it's it's uh and uh uh I mean I remember the Vietnam War with me, you know. Uh I went not to the guard, you know. Uh uh you, you gotta have there's no there's no uh 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 uh, Free ride. No I would say this: no appreciation stuff with some people. No appreciation for this country. They don't really have, know how good they have it. Right, right. And who's they? You and me and other people. Yeah, right. It's it's That's it's awesome. like because they is like a huge number. It's yeah. like it, people don't understand um, that it's not automatic. And it's no. just, it's kind of an interesting thing. It, it has to do with how long we can remember stuff. I, I'm i very aware of how fragile things are because my dad was in World War II. Yeah. You know what I mean? Um, you're very aware because you were right of age for the Vietnam War. Right. You know? I know what, like one of my friends from eighth grade, his goal, and he did it two weeks ago, he took his two children with the, with the spouses and they went to Normandy, and he saw where his father was. Wow. Okay. So, yeah. See, there's a family, he, and that's that going to live on in that family now, generations yeah. down, who get it. Yeah. That's, let's uh, move on here. I Have mean, seriously. Heard of, Mark, I've, I've been really uh, ignorant on this. Have you ever heard of Waymo? No. Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't know. I can't I can't speak to it, though. It's a taxi list of drivers. It's interesting. They had a test in San Francisco, a cruise driverless car collided with a fire truck responding to an emergency. Another cruise vehicle got stuck in wet concrete. The week before, several <laughs> cruise cars blocked traffic in the season. That's beautiful. Beach. One of the Friday state regulators asked crews to have the number of vehicles that operated. Yeah. But I, I look forward to that to see how it's going to be. I mean, I think it's going to be like a really – like not that that I wanted to do it, I wanted to be, but my gosh, I would say, my gosh, and this as I'm still alive, and that's happening. It's like, um, yeah, yeah, you know, um, yeah. I mean, that's always that's always kind of what you do is when you go like, um, you know, okay, this is uh 2023, um, and then you go back 50 years, it's 1973, and then you think, okay, that wasn't that far back, but then you go. What was 50 years from 1973? 1923, right? Right. And 1923 seems like a million years ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So the it's, fact uh, that in our lifetime, we're talking about things like this is really amazing. Yeah. Let me tell you, let's get to sports of sports. I got I to gotta tell you this. I watched the game last night about 11 o'clock at night. It was uh, Cincinnati. In Arizona. All right. We're on. It's in the 10th inning. And um, I hope I get some of my facts. I hope I get some of my facts. I hope I get them all straight. You're like, and what yeah, happens? Just get, just get a happens? few of them. Just get a, a good percentage of them. Cincinnati is winning like eight to five. Or seven, eight to five by three. They're, I, no, 
in the 10th inning now. Okay. Um, so then uh, Arizona comes to bat. They go one run, then another run. Now it's uh, one out, and they're losing by one. They hit the ball to the second baseman. It goes right through his legs. Oh, my God. All right? Wow. Side game, side score. Right through his legs, okay? They blew a three-point lead, right? Wait, wait, who's in the field? Arizona. No, okay. no, Cincinnati. Cincinnati, okay. They blew it, right? So now they go the next inning. And um, the amazing thing about baseball, next inning, and uh, Cincinnati's got a man on third, I think a man on first, man on third for sure, a man on first. Um, it looks like the guy's going to get a mouth, you know, uh, for uh, to go to a. It would be a tie, you know. They go to the next inning, um, and what happens? The uh, the pitcher commits a balk, <laughs> a balk, and everybody's solid. It wasn't like arguing. It, so it wasn't like it wasn't one of those where you go, I didn't even see it. I don't even know what they're talking about. Yeah, yeah. Even on the replay, okay. The buck, he flinched. Yeah, so he goes by one point. Now they're winning by one. Arizona comes to bat as a home team. It's they scored three runs the inning before zero. That run, Cincinnati wins the game over a wow. on a buck. Wow. No, huh? No, that's cool. And then football gets ready to go. I know you're you're not into it, but I do my fantasy draft this Wednesday night. Yeah. So we have to have some picks uh, next time we talk, huh? Um, yeah. What, what do you think since we say, I, I feel for the guy, Otani. He's, he, his, his, his value as a pitcher is not going down, right? Oh, because you're talking about if he's going to sign free agency? Yeah, if he slides free agency, you know. Oh, because he's gonna he's so they put him on the shelf as far as pitching goes the rest right, of right. the year. Right. They shut shut him down and then but he's still D eight. Right, right. The rest of the year. Yeah, I think this is more uh, I don't know if um uh free agent just negotiations would hinge on that because if, if you look at starts, he's what does he probably have three, four more starts? And the Angels are not gonna make the pl make it. No, no. So I mean, he, if if he, I'm saying, if they were in the pennant race, he'd still be pitching. I think. I thought he's gonna have surgery. Oh, is he? I, think. No, I don't know. I don't know. I, don't, I, don't I gotta know. check. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Alexa, is uh, Otani gonna have surgery? No. No. Yes, thank you. Right. Alexa said no. Okay. Uh, we'll uh, we'll double we'll uh, uh, fact check Alexa. Well, because they say he's like he's out for the season, so I thought. Yeah, but they do that to pitchers all the time. They shut him yeah, down. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. All right. I, yeah. I was in a hurry too. Okay. Yeah. How are we doing on time? We got to wrap this up. Okay. Let's wrap it up. Good conversation, Mark. All right. You what? You want to thank everybody, or should, should I? I well, let's. We both should. All right. You go first. We're a team here, right? And we both play. Yeah. Right. right. I, thank you for listening. We enjoy uh, your comments. When you see me, you talk to me about it, and uh, I listen to your comments. And we always want to get better. Thank you. Sounds good. Exactly. Everybody take it easy. Thank you very much. We appreciate it.